The Technion opened its gates in 1924. About a year later, there was a formal ceremony in Tubishvat, 1925. During this ceremony, Menachem Osishkin, one of the greatest Zionist leaders of the time and a mining engineer by profession, addressed the audience and spoke about research. And he said, applied research and pure research are two sides of the same coin. And this is so true. Pure research is driven by curiosity. Curiosity to understand the world. Curiosity to understand nature. When Professor Hershko and Professor Chikanova discovered how proteins are degraded in our body, they didn't have any medication in mind. They had this sense of curiosity that made them spend days after days in a small laboratory attempting to understand how our body works. Years later, this discovery led to medications that are used by cancer patients all over the world. The Technion is one of the places where pure research is translated into applications, into innovative technologies. And innovations made at the Technion affect almost every person around the world, be it the compression algorithm developed by Professor Lempel and Professor Ziv during the 70s, or the anti-Parkinson drug, Azilect, developed by Professor Yudim and Professor Finberg. It all starts by the need to learn more about our body, about the world around us, or about the stars. Albert Einstein said, never stop questioning. Curiosity has its own reason of existence. Israel survived because of one abundant resources, brain power. When you invest in nurturing the mind of the technical students and technical scientists, you invest in our shared future. You invest in the future of Israel.